So after my lovely meal that I had, which was ribs, jack of potato, and the filling was um, tuna in spring water, and then I put spring onions, cucumber, and then I did cut up some tomatoes. And I thought, mm, do I put them in with the tuna? It didn't seem quite right, so I just had them on the side. And yeah, I did a little vlog of what I was eating. And now for my dessert, I'll be having this lint chocolate. It's so nice, as I'm being really healthy. I'm doing my running and everything in the mornings from half five. So I'm being really, really good. But, so this is my dessert, but look what's staring me in the face. Easter egg. Easter egg. Easter egg. Easter egg. Don't know if I can hold them all. Easter egg. I'll put that one down because it's quite big. And Easter egg. I don't know if I can put them all in. Look. Look how many Easter eggs we've got. <laughs> Lays from my mum and dad. Which I love to bits. Thank you ever so much. There's so much chocolate. But what we're going to do, we're going to be really good in the week. And then we can have a treat day uh, on the weekend. But oh my god. Look at the chocolate. So we have a lint one. A Capri's. Uh, Nes Neswick chocolate and I'm sure this one is mm, I've got a funny feeling this might be the galaxy that might be the galaxy I don't think that's the galaxy I think that's the galaxy but the lint one is nice so, yeah, so we've got loads and loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of Easter eggs. So I hope you guys had a lovely Easter and you got loads and loads of Easter eggs as well. Yeah, so all I'm having for my dessert is this one. So let's open it. Ooh. Lint chocolate is so nice. This is so nice. Mm. That is my dessert. So, I can't wait to try the limp one as well. wonder if this has got a little bit of mint in it. That would be interesting. So yeah, look at all the Easter eggs. Look how many Easter eggs there are. There's loads. Loads, loads, loads. But I like to keep them in the fridge. Nice chocolate's really nice in the fridge. Really nice. So yeah. So that is me done. So I've had, no, I didn't have breakfast. No, I had an egg. I had an egg for breakfast with a coffee. And then for lunch, I had a soup, vegetable soup with granary seeded bread. And then drinking plenty of water throughout the day with coffee. And then for my evening meal, um, I had a lovely rib jacket potato. I will show you on here. Look at my healthy dinner for tonight. So I've got there you go. Rebecca ribs, and I've got sliced tomato, and I've got tuna with spring onions, cucumber, with just a tiny bit of light mayo, with a jacket potato. I've actually done 
tea, but I think I'm only going to eat one. And do you know what? I've done two jack of potatoes, and I had one and a half. So, I was pretty good. I didn't think I was going to eat all that, because it was, like, quite a lot of food. But, um, yeah, so I didn't have much food today. And I thought, right, I need to have a fair bit now. But it's all, all is good. So I've done two runs so far um, at half five in the morning. <laughs> so I'm thinking, do I have a rest day tomorrow or do I just brave it and go and do it? I must admit, my legs are hurting today. I did struggle, struggle a little bit at work, but I got through. I got through. So yeah, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to have a nice... Mm. It's either going to be a coffee, which I really fancy a coffee, or it might be a hot chocolate, but I really fancy a coffee, but I'm thinking, mm, I've got to sleep tonight as well, so I'm indecisive what I'm going to have. But yeah, it's either going to be a hot chocolate or a coffee. I think I'll go for coffee. So, there we go. Anyway guys, have a good evening, and I'll see you soon.